Here I will demonstrate the integration of SAGE data and the key driver analysis into a gene pattern workflow. I will use gene expression data from, TC from the TCGA project as well to demonstrate the integration of the existing gene pattern tools and infrastructure and to provide an example of how key driver analysis may be used. Our workflow will consist of finding differentially expressed genes in the TCGA dataset using a gene pattern module called comparative marker selection running the key driver analysis using the SAGE lung cancer network model along with the differentially expressed genes found, as found in the TCGA data, and visualizing the results in Cytoscape. Of course, there's also a few data transformation steps required. To start, let's take a quick look at the gene expression data. The gene expression data is in a gene pattern GCT file format. This is simply a tab delimited format with the sample names being provided as column headers along the top and genes being provided on the row names along with the expression values. We will also use a class file. This class file differentiates the samples in our gene expression file between two classes. Typically this differentiation would be specified based on some phenotypic differences. Here it's actually essentially just an arbitrary distinction. So to start we're going to run the comparative marker selection analysis in gene pattern. So we'll go to genelist selection, select comparative marker selection, and we will give it the gene expression file and the class file to run on. When this analysis completes, the results become available. And before we proceed, we'll take a quick look at what the results look like. So I will automatically send this to the Comparative Marker Selection Viewer and provide it with the data set as well. And this provides us with a view of various statistical properties on the markers that were selected. Um, such as the p-value, Bonferroni correction, etc. I can also take a look at the data as a heat map if I choose. Now the next step will be to prepare the data for key driver analysis. For that we need to reformat the data. For this first we need to run extract comparative marker results. We will send it the data from comparative marker selection and we will choose the top 200 ranked genes from the analysis. The output of this includes a gene list with those top 200 genes. And what we will do next is to transform that gene list into the right format for KDA using GeneList to KDA list, a new module built for this demo. Now that our GeneList is reformatted, we can proceed with key driver analysis itself. So I will select the SAGE key driver analysis from the SAGE category. I will Provide it with the input gene list that we just created. And I will also provide it with the lung cancer network model that we got from SAGE. And I'm going to adjust the parameters slightly and run key driver analysis. This generates several output files. Most significant for us in this case is the sys.zip file. We would like to view this in Cytoscape. To do that, we first need to transform it again in order to reformat the, the output for Cytoscape. We have another module created by Alex Pico called Sage KDA to sys, which we will run on the output. And now with the transformed sys file, 
we can launch Cytoscape to view the results of the key driver analysis. As I am not a biologist, and this is just a tools demonstration, I will not attempt to analyze this data or, or interpret this data here. Uh, but this pipeline is available for those of you who are interested on the gene pattern test server built as a gene pattern workflow. Now, if I wish to create a workflow from this, I can do that automatically. One example would be to just click on the output files and say create pipeline. But I've already saved a public copy of this pipeline for people to use called Sage KDA Example 2, which includes all of the steps that you just saw here which is now available on the gene pattern test server. This includes all of the necessary input files as well as all of the parameter settings. Once these modules, these new modules, the Sage key driver analysis and the transformation modules have been fully quality assured, they will become available on the public gene pattern server as well. That is the end of this demo.